Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss what table is based in Oracle SQL Developer. So, anything in Oracle SQL Developer, so we can do by two ways. So, first is by graphically and next by query. So, in my, uh, when I create at your table space in Oracle database, so there I used uh, how to create table space by query method. So, let's see how to create uh, a table space by graphically. So, for this first, uh, go to view and here you can find DBA. Click there. Now, here after add connection. So, it should be connected with uh, our systems because system has uh, all the uh, privilege. Now, here after click on OK. So, system it's added. Now, here after. So, here you can find database configuration status form and here you can find add here. Or storage. Now click the storage and here you can find data files and here table space. So this is the table space that are already there. Now here after I'm going to create the table space. Right click and here after you can find create new. So click the create new. Now here this is the name of the table space. Now here after let's give a meaningful name of table space. So going to give at here dbl space example. Now here after let's give meaningful a name of a uh, name here. So at here this is the name dbl space. Now here let's give dbl underscore sp. Now here after we need to specify the directory. So I'm going to save into C -tramp. and here there you can find tamp one folder. So there is a already one data files there. Copy that path and here paste into the directory. Now here after how many size you want to give. So let's give add here 50 and here after you should click add here drop down here you can find KB mb gigabyte here so let's select add here m so m that indicate mb now here after reuse and here this is add here auto extend so auto extends so for how many so i'm going to select and add here it will auto extend on 50 mb so not going to specify max size here now here after the next is so we can create add here table space or by or using at your permanent temporary undo so that means table space has three kind first is permanent temporary and undo now here after this the property of a permanent so at at your file time so you can give at your small big so let's give at your small here online status so here you can specify online so if the online status then you can do any kind of performance like uh, creating tables, sequence, index, all those things. Here you can, if you want, then here you can uh, give the block size. It's uh, optional. Now, here after login. So, at here login, not login, you set specify anyone. Now, here after this, the segment. So, let's give auto and here this is at here extend management tab. Okay, local. Now, here after auto allocated. And if you unselect here, you can specify a uh, uniform size. So I'm going to select at here auto allocated. Now here default parameter. So at here it should be let's give no compress and other option you can also select. Now here DDL. So this is the query that will uh, generate. So now here after all those things, it has been turned. Now here after click on OK. So at here, there is so a TBL space example, it's a generator. So when the at here table space generated, there is a one a data files created. So go to data files and here you can find a TBL underscore SP. So that directory, it was only F D B F. Now here you can find TBL underscore SP. So at here, uh, one more thing. So at here, uh, it's a not a TBL file. Okay, when you see the properties, so here there is a file it's created. Now here, 
right so go to advanced so this is our file is not a db file so we, what we need to do add here so when uh, we are creating add here table space then the file type must be dot dbf so add here database files must be created okay now here after let's uh, create one more time so here create new and here there are okay three options when i select add here tempo temporary so add here you can uh, only find three tabs file specification properties and data now if i select add here undo only three file specification properties and you get three options and here data now here after that select permanent and here you can get four tabs so add here let's give a uh, table space name so going to write add here tbl underscore sp now here after we need to specify at this point name of data files so add here write the tbl dot dbl now here I give the directory now here after let's give uh, add here file size let's give this time 100 and here select to mbkb reuse extends here not going to use and here let's give 15 and here we need to specify mb now properties let's select a small here online here login here auto and here local now if you select local here auto allocated is it's never so add here now here after default here no compression and here this is the key that going to generate when I press OK. So right here there is a one table or uh, table space is created tbl underscore sp underscore c and here there is a one uh, tbl dot dbf file it's created. So right here dbl uh, dot dbf file it's created and here after the next thing is so double click on this now here you can create to uh, detail table space name block size initial all those things here login information force logging and here extend manager and here after segment auto all those things now here you can get the data files information so id here total mb used pre this all those things so this the uh, pre space table is one minimum Average max total. So this is the way we can create the table space graphically by using Oracle SQL Developer. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.